Today's problem is the nothing on the pool pump, um, pool heater, blower, anything was working. Um, but the strange thing is that I was getting power uh, to the box, but not 110. I was getting less than 110. I had never seen that before. So here's what I did to solve it. Very careful here, of course. Um, we got some serious power. Um, you can get shocked if you have no idea at all what you're doing. Uh, you shouldn't do this or make sure you follow instructions. Um, I checked right here. Make sure I don't really touch this. Okay, I checked here on the stubble pole. This is what goes to the pole area. Okay and let me get closer here okay so i was getting i don't know why this is not focusing i was getting um 120 on the bottom one if i recall but only like 75 on the top okay um afterwards i figured it out of course what i always do if you watch some of my other videos how i even fix stuff without you know, actually fix what I call fix instead of replacing parts is I took it apart and I find out how it works and now you know I wouldn't have even had to spend the ten dollars for this new part but if you check if you put let's say the red here or actually let me get my multimeter okay so if uh, for example you put this here okay you put this here and you put this back there on the ground okay where you see all these wires going into or you could even do it up there I choose always to do it here okay if you do that uh, you should get over 110 of course uh, 120 125 if I recall what I was getting um, you know, work one hand uh, with the camera, one hand, I'm not going to do it again. But, um, you sh so you should, again, you should get over 110 here and over 110. When I did that, again, I was getting 120 something here and 75 up here. So that led me to believe that this part of this double pole uh, was bad. Okay. So, at, oh, and at the same time, if you did this here, okay, and the red one, okay, there, you should get over 220, okay? And I wasn't getting over 220. So again, that led me to believe uh, this half here was bad. So really easy. Just went, uh, of course, got a Home Depot close by, went to Home Depot, and I try always to replace with the same thing not focusing there we go much better okay so I always as you can see same thing so this is a double pole 60 amp okay now again <laughs> you don't want to touch nothing there so if you don't know what you're doing be very careful okay uh, the first thing you want to do is of course turn this off okay once you turn this off this will turn off all the power to the house. There's where it comes in, okay? And then after you do that, check again to make sure, even though it should be completely off, check again to make 100% sure there's no power there. After I did that, okay, get a flathead screwdriver as you can see there, and point and camera, okay? And there, take that out a little bit and that wire will come out. Take that out right there, and that wire will come out. After that comes off, and of course, that this, for those of you that want to criticize, that would be off too. But again, the main thing, you want to be 100% sure, I cannot say that enough, that there's no power there and nothing left there. So after that comes out, let me show you as I always like to do so you know what you're working with. This is what this looks like, okay? Okay, see the shape that's in? What happens is it goes in like this and clips. So of course to take it out, you're gonna 
grab it really hard as I'm doing here and this will come out which that's what's grabbing it there okay so it's gonna come out this way and then it's gonna release right there okay so really easy so and again I'm taking longer to explain it than the time it took me to do this so you take that off okay this is this is the bad one here and the new one which is there again um, this part here on the right of the camera those clips will go in there carefully you're gonna feel it that, that part was a little tricky okay I don't want to show you now actually I can't but the way it goes in there it's a little tricky what you want to do if you're like me lucky to be able to find very similar part this should match right here as you see okay and again this part here is going to clip in and then you're just going to push on the uh, left hand side you're going to push that in and it will it will just click again okay so once that is in there in reverse okay put the red wire in there tighten that up real good make sure you know the wire is in there hundred percent same thing with the black one tighten that up I always like to you know take a couple of seconds a minute whatever check around make sure again the power was off before doing all this after you're hundred percent sure that's on then you want to go ahead and turn the uh, main power on and that and then you know you would check and you would see again that you have 110 or probably above here 110 or above here or if you did one on checked one on the top okay and one on the bottom you should have over over 220 um, again as you know my videos I'm not here to make perfect cute little videos try to show you exactly what I did how I did it um, and hopefully I can save you some money I have no idea how much if I had an electrician come by he would have charged me and I'm, I'm sure several hundred dollars uh, many years ago an idiot that installed the uh, from the pool company the pool pump installed it wrong and made this main one go out and I was charged seven hundred and fifty dollars to replace uh, that one there so you know I'm sure I saved probably over two three hundred dollars uh, to have an actual electrician come out if you don't feel safe again I don't want, I'm sure I've said it a hundred times but if you don't f feel safe messing with this this will blow your your fingers your whole arm off if you don't know what you're doing so this is serious stuff guys um, if you have any questions any comments anything you would have done differently if you know more about electricity than I do uh, please comment uh, again all we're here to do is help people and help people save some money so that's all I got for this one made it a little longer than it should have um, if you like the video if it helped you please like the video share it and subscribe to the channel Patriot Marine out